I'm Debbie Mercer, Dean of the College of Education at Kansas State University, and today we're at Stuckey Middle School to crash the class of Mr. Logan Kaywood. Logan is an early career music education teacher, so join us as we crash his class. We have this series called Crash the Class. And we go out to classrooms all across the state of Kansas and we surprise teachers that graduated from K-State. And our whole, our whole purpose is to just lift them up and give, have an opportunity to say thank you to them because they're doing such a fabulous job. And you all have a rock star in Mr. Kaywood. These people, these people suck at lying. <laughs> They're the worst liars. So I am good. I am good. So your principal is a rock star. They have been doing exactly what you ask of them the entire time, right? Yeah, yeah. So you have a great group. I need you to put this yes, on. So Kyle was here yesterday. He did some droning around outside. He oh. talked to um, some of your colleagues, your principal, and we have a video to show you because we have oh, just crashed your stop. middle room, middle music room. <laughs> no, I'm not crying yet. I'm, I'm, shh, I'm good. I'm good. I'm thriving. Okay. We're good. Yep. Are you sure? No. Logan has always been a self-starter, someone who is very engaged. He's also very motivated and always looks for the best in every situation. Logan, we are so proud of all the work that you're doing in the schools and the music that you're continuing to make with your students. We cannot wait to see what the next several years hold for you as you continue to grow as a musician, a teacher, and a valued community member. Keep up the great work. Logan is a really strong teacher and has been from the get-go. Um, he is willing to do um, whatever he can do to make sure that kids have a great experience in vocal music. So Logan, you know that you're my guy. I appreciate you. I, um, I feel very invested in your career, especially since um, I was there pretty much the first day that it started um, in the USD 259. You're a great leader, you're a great teacher, you have a passion for kids and a passion for education. I'm so proud of you and I know you're going to be a great success. Um, something that stands out to me about Mr. K. Wood is one, he's a great teacher. Um, he cares about the kids, but he also sets like limits and, and holds them accountable. What impresses me most is his confidence. He seems so confident no matter what situation he's in. He's always someone you can talk to, bounce things off of. He'll kind of help you figure things out. Um, on a personal note, he can make you laugh. Ooh, Mr. K. Wood, he's like, he's very inclusive. He always wants you to feel happy and like, wants you to succeed the most in class and just like really enjoy what he is teaching. It's like a comedy class, but like we actually learn. It's kind of weird. Okay, Dan. <laughs> Mr. Kaywood, he's a very professional and creative teacher. I love his lessons that he does because they're always new and they're not like the same thing over and over. He's really good at paying attention to the kids and seeing their strengths and their weaknesses and helping them improve themselves to become a better singer and musician. I just want to say thank you to you because You've made this experience in choir such an amazing experience, and you have improved me as a human being and a musician. Mr. Kaywood, he is a very good person, and I like that he's always, like, cares about us, and, like, he treats us like we were his children. I would say thank you for putting up with me for three hours in a row every day. I just joined choir this year, but since the beginning, it's been a really fun experience. Thank you. Um, you've really opened opened me up to music a lot more than before. Uh, thank you, Mr. Kaywood, for the short time that I have been here. Thank you for making it seem like I actually like fit in with the choir group. Um, Mr. Kaywood, I really enjoy how you really try to see the best version of me, even though like sometimes I might be a little 
attitude -y. Um, You really still get on me and you haven't gave up on me and I really appreciate that. Mr. Kawit is awesome. Like he plays music during class and is sarcastic and stuff and it's really, really funny. Mr. Kawit, thank you a lot for being able to teach us how you do and for giving us so many opportunities to grow as choir students and singers. I wouldn't want any other choir teacher. Thank, Thank you. you. Thanks, guys. So Crash the Class is all about lifting the profession, right? And you got to hear your students say some things, your colleagues hear some uh, hear some things from your colleagues that we don't always say. Right. So my challenge to each one of you is, we're here celebrating Mr. Kaywood today, but you have other teachers that are phenomenal at Stuckey Middle School, and I want you to take an opportunity to tell them that. But as someone said, today is about you, okay? And we know that you've had such an impact, and for me, the ultimate definition of a good teacher, a good teacher, is someone that cares. Thank you for letting us crash your music classroom. Your students were awesome, and we have some things to leave with you. You may um, have had a couple of requests about what you might like in your room. Oh, that makes sense, mm -hmm. what Dr. Payne asked, okay. Yes, Dr. Payne, so he said you needed drums, so we have drums for you, Thank so you. we'll leave those. You had some other things that Pam miraculously pulled together, awesome. like only Pam Monroe right. can do, right? And so they're there, we'll leave all those things, and then I think you planted a seed with your principal, and um, maybe good things will just okay. continue to happen and come into your room but thank you to all of all of you for letting us crash and thank you I'm so proud thank of you, you. <laughs> you're good ready three four crash!